Okay. In you go. Stay safe, brother. Diver, in the water at 300 feet. Bell, do you copy? Comms check. Comms check. Slow your breathing down for me, okay? You're pushing too hard. Copy. We're on the job now. Keep the focus where it needs to be. Diver one. Begin equalization. Try to work my magic. The thrusters have gone offline. How many? All of them. The ship's moving. Get out of there. Right now. Copy that. A smack. There is no more slack. That's everything I've got. The ship's not drifting. Chris has become our icon. That's never gonna hold. Chris, on me. What happens now? Your umbilical. It's gonna snap. I will come back for you, but you have to get yourself back to the top. I can't rescue you if I can't find you. Understand? Just make sure I'm alright, though. Where's our power? Dead in the water. We're drifting out of control. How much gas does you have left? Not enough. We're gonna be too late. It's a body recovery now. No, it's not. I'm not losing a diver today. Duncan! Dave! I can't see you! I got an idea. I have to take control of the ship manually. If we make a mistake, we put the entire ship at risk. Come on! This isn't working! You can do this, buddy. I'm with you. Incoming swell. Brace for impact. No! No! Chris! Cyber! Where are you? Brian, why are you doing this? Jeez, that's that's kind of like asking what life is all about. I don't know. Well, I was obsessive about flying. So here we have you in a younger form. <laughs> Pretty handsome, right? <laughs> Scene one. They're doing what? Building a human-powered plane. Just for kicks? No, no, no. There's a prize, hundred thousand dollars. I'm coming for the crown. The team, each one of them, was very unique and not in any way ordinary. 
We all had our problems and we all had our superpowers. Cause I'm coming for the crown. Brian was an extremely good hang glider pilot. I had like 75 crashes. <laughs> Paul was kind of like a visionary. I've calculated that we can bring down the weight. And what are we going to call it? The Gossamer Penguin. The what? Penguins don't fly. Man throughout history has been seized with this symbolic compulsion to fly. It's spiritual, it's elemental, and usually terribly unsuccessful. It was definitely a race, it was definitely a competition. France built the Aviette, and Japan also had their eye on the prize. we got to get this done as soon as we can. We are definitely not ready to actually achieve this. Word has gone out to every major television station in the world. The plane is going to fly across the English Channel to the coast of France. Well, it's about 22 miles. We've never flown the plane over water. What kind of safety mechanisms were in place? Uh, basically nothing. <laughs> if I go in the water, I'm going to go instantaneously into thermal shock. Looking at the weather, it's going to be a real crapshoot. And I'm a terrible swimmer. Go ahead. You'll never do it. <laughs>